これほど美しき景色を見ればおのずと旅がしたくなるものであろう手元に葉があるのなら拙者が草笛で一曲奏でよう。And, uh, <笑> Emma, welcome to the Twitch stream. You made it for your、uh, made it for your thirty seconds, and you're gonna go get a drink. Alrighty. See you in a sec. But thanks for making your milestone, I guess. Your、uh, objective. Hope I didn't、uh, put you out too much to do that. Okay. Make sure that's running. Okay. I should have everything basically set up. Okay. I think we're good. I think we're good. I think we're good. I think we're good. Yeah, there we go. Okay. We're clear. Let's see. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Where am I? Or what am I doing? What was I doing? I think I still need to use 40 more resin. Might have to do that really briefly.、Uh, I guess I'll have to claim this in a second, too. Domain challenges. Yeah, okay. I guess the first thing I'll do is maybe use some resin. Do we have room to make a condensed? I can make one more condensed. I'll just do that. Get a setup for the、uh, Sunday grind. One more of these. Alright. Back to it. I had to, to use 40 more resin. Or, I guess 30 more resin, but. Can't use anything in 30s right now. Claim that. Level 3. Let's go, let's go. And then I'll claim those tomorrow. Or, I don't know, maybe later. Oh, yeah. And then, of course, these treasure compasses are telling me to go underground, which is. Unfortunate. I guess I should try to start doing some of these. Which one is this? Oh, right, I stumbled upon something, didn't I? Okay. Yeah, there's like a there's like a cave or a drop down into a hole. You cool. There's still too many things I probably haven't seen in this place. I don't know. I, I feel paranoid. Now that I haven't been doing this systematic stuff recently, I feel I feel so paranoid. And then I just walk I walk through the area again, and it's like everything's cleared. So, I don't know. I'm going crazy. You We walked to the blank earlier. So that. These are all pine wood, right? Yeah, it's all pine wood there. Okay. I don't think I'm ready to go to the, the wharf yet. We just have to cross the bridge and we can go to the wharf. But maybe I want to do this side quest first. Emma, you are back. Yes, sir. First message was、uh, within the、uh, 30 second marker, I guess, but being active. Did I? Am I inside the. Oh, okay. Oh, there was a hole. Okay. I thought I glitched inside somehow. Um, sorry. Um, 
you made it for your 30 seconds, but you sort of, I mean, sort of, you weren't ready, though. It's like making it to class, but you weren't ready. <clears throat> oh, hey, no problem. That's fine. No problem, no problem. Isa. I mean, you've been trying to fix your sleep schedule too, right? Like, I'm not, I'm not helping with that. The way I, the way I stream, it's not helping. But you have been, I know you've been trying to uh, establish a working sleep schedule. So. You cool? That's fine. That's fine. If you need to do, uh, you cool? If you need to do that, then not intentionally. <laughs> Isa. Yeah, it's fine. If you needed to sleep, then. Your body was telling you you needed to sleep more than you needed uh, to pick your entertainment for the night. Oh, oh. Okay, yeah, we're going farther in here. There's a chest down there, but I kind of want to hit this cave first. I think this is going to be more contained. At least we, at least we kind of know it's like just inside of here. Let's get in there. It's fine, not the end of the world to miss one stream. I mean heck, even the stream even the streamer is okay with it, you know? So should you. <laughs> if anyone should be upset about missing the stream, it should be me. But I'm not, so. No worries, no worries. You 1v1 to champ 2? Okay, and you almost won it? Hold on, are we talking champ 2 in 1v1s? Or champ 2, like, as their normal 2s or 3s rank? Why are there just random things you can pick up and then you just get, like, two frogs? What? Okay, champ 2 and 2s. Alright, alright. Champ in twos and threes. Okay, that's fine. I don't know. Peak was C2. Okay. Wait, what did I just. Did I hit something? I hit. Okay. I hit something. You cool. Peak was C3. Nice, nice, nice. See, but then. I don't know. Like. It also. You have to think about what their one. Game it, I mean, they've had this conversation, right? Like. It's a very different game playing one, so you kind of have to you kind of have to consider, you know, what rank he is or what what rank they are in, in one I mean, heck, I pe I peaked C one, but I'm freaking like plat two in in one I think. You <clears throat> cool? Okay, well that's fine. No big deal. You, I mean, you almost won, so there you go. I wonder if I can... Ooh, I wonder if these things that I'm supposed to hit... Yeah, because any all these hits, I just tab them and I get a whole bunch of stuff. I hope you can do that more than once. What the heck? Chase the butterflies into the medicine jar. Okay, so I'm looking for butterflies. I know they're the green ones. How do I get up there? Or can I get up there? There's this thing over here. Ooh. Puzzle down here? That's our guy. As long as I'm like a butterfly perched on a stag leg, right? I should place on the stone stand like a butterfly alighting on the stalagmite. Right? I mean, I think that that is the right spot. Yeah, okay, no, he moves into position. Perched on a stalagmite. Right? What, is this the one? <sighs> oh, okay. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Do I catch it? Where's he going? Oh! Oh no, okay. I think we just... 
Did we do it? Did we chase the butterfly into the medicine jar? Oh, kind of. Oh, yeah, we did. We did. Okay, good. Nice. Alrighty, alrighty. Apparently that works. And I, apparently the definition of chase here is to, uh, to do a puzzle and then just watch it go away from you without flying into the air to try to get to it. Where's the next spot? Is it that way? Wait, where? Hold on. Oh, it's down that way. I see it. Go! Activate. Nice, nice. It's kind of weird doing some of these time challenges when, like, you just kind of hit the activate button and then it just kind of swims you around to hit all of the stuff, like, automatically. Aim. Ooh, I got him. Okay, and then we got this one. There he goes. Okay, two out of five, two out of five. Okay, so it's not really like I have to really look. I just have to look for puzzles. Yeah, cool. Anything, anything. Rocks. Smash! Hello. <laughs> Rocks. Yeah. I don't know. I get excited because I actually found like something that's that's openable. This was a, it was an old it's an old Lian mechanic. When you see when you see sort of fragile rocks like that, you know there's either some form of like chest or, or thing that's going to be behind it. So, or the fact that it's going to be your uh, it's going to increase your exploration progress. You know, because I like the numbers. I like these numbers. I need to get more numbers, higher numbers. I have to go into here, I think. Is that a, is there a spider on that? There is a spider on that. Hey! Same. Same. I like that too. I would very much... I would very much like bigger ones. Though. Hello. I've been found out. Oh, there's one more guy. Got him. You have three numbers in your bank account, and two of them are zeros. What, 300? 900? <laughs> They are the change. Yeah. Oh, just to go up there. You got it. Kazuha helps us cheese it again. I'm not sure how I feel about the word hit on all of those things. Kind of weird. Give me the steak. Give me that raw steak. Isa. Hey, she's got twenty thousand dollars. And up. And nothing here. We can hit another thing. Glaze lilies? Why are there glaze lilies in here? Isa. Mm. 
Oh, catch butterfly. Retrieve four scattered Yuko. butterflies. Catch butterfly. Hello. Number two, second butterfly. Where is three and four? I don't know. Oh, three and four. Okay, there's three. There's three. There we go. Troy, welcome to the YouTube stream. Thanks for tuning in. How are things? I don't know if I asked uh, you, Emma. How are things as well? Other than, uh, you know, falling asleep last night. <laughs> Troy, you're over in the Twitch as well. Hello, hello. Good to see you. <laughs> Hold on, where is this? Where is this fourth butterfly? I need one more purple butterfly. Found. Oh, oh, it's inside the pot. Nice. Isa. Nice. Chase him back. Chase him back to the medicine pot. So they're like. Glowing butterflies of different colors, I guess. Great, we're at four to five. You know what that means? There's one more. And one more is always the worst part of any game. It's always the it's always the last one. <laughs> Troy, you named him Scaramouche? They let you name him Scaramouche? Okay. I thought I saw like a YouTube video of like, someone trying to name him different names, and then it basically showed like all the um, all the rejected names. It, it would like it would like they, he basically went through a bunch of names that like they rejected. They don't let you. Oh, he took out the E at the end. Oh, okay. So you did more of Scaramouche or something. I don't know. Okay. Okay. His name is Scaramouche. All right, all right. I mean, I guess they didn't uh, they didn't check uh, carefully enough, I suppose. Oh gosh, what are we gonna do? There's one more butterfly to find, and I can't even I don't even know where the, that puzzle would be. Yeah, let me get one of those. Let me get one of them bubbles that let me float around in the air. Okay, I've been there. Um, I think I've been here. Yeah, this is the hilly trail one. Oh, just look for pots, right? They're always in those little. There's always in the the pots on the bottom, I think, right? Cave here. No, but that was that was the one I already fought out. The guy in the corner. That was that was the rock. Um, this is where we came in. Oh, I guess this is just talking to him, right? Oh. Oh, okay, so he, he gives you a hint of where they are if you don't find them. Uh, finish the Sumeru Archon, busy with the Hydro Archon quest. Oh, uh, okay, okay. Uh, Emma, it's not a bad, it's, no, no, it's not, it's not a bad word. Scarmosh is not a bad word, or Scarmoosh, um, is not a bad word. It's, um, you'll know when you get to the Sumeru, like, when you go through the Sumeru, Sumeru um, quest line, um, I guess to try to minimize the spoiler here, it's just that, you know, if you're trying to change your name, it's redundant to try to put your name like okay, you if you were trying to change your name, it would be redundant for someone to say, Hey, why don't you name yourself Emma? That that's basically that was basically it. Or that's basically the premise of it. Oh, I was right here. Oh, I was here already. Oh, okay. 
Wait, it is this one, right? Yeah, okay, he's inside. He's in the barrier here. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, I picked up a pot. Do I put it on here? Did that do anything? It kind of moved into position, so that signals to me there's probably something right. Yeah, I was just I was just in this area. Get the resources. Two butterfly wings. Wait. Oh, do I need? To, oh, are these the keys to open things? Oh, here we go. And then we open up the second one. We get the second one here. Got it. Wait, there's probably another thing. Uh. One here? Oh, no, I just need two. No, I just need two. That's what it is. Got it. Wait. Oh, went up. Yay! Got him. The adeptal tree looks the same. We gotta go talk to that statue again. It's okay, Troy. I got it. I got it. I'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. In general, for these puzzles, I'm gonna... I would prefer to try to see if I can figure them out. And even if it takes me time to do it, I'm okay with that. I don't know. It's, I just feel that way with like Genshin specifically. <clears throat> yeah, I get with, with it's, it's a weird thing I have. It's like, with Genshin, I want to like figure out how to do things myself, type of thing, right? I don't, for, like it's it's for whatever reason, this is one of those games. I just I don't want to, um, I don't want to like search things up or have someone tell me how to do things and whatever, right? Um, sorry, I don't mean to call out about that, but your AR6 on the American account, nice, nice. For context, Emma, uh, Troy has created a North America server account last night, so there he's he's gunning for the last slot on my friends list. <laughs> oh shoot! What did he say? Oh crap! Wait! 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 Herb Housing Hall. <laughs> going faster than you well again it's the the early stages right early stages oh shoot what did he say oh crap crap crap, crap. wait 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 i have to like i have to rewind hold on wait 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 i gotta i gotta rewind and see what he said shoot i mm. I, I was I was like subconsciously clicking through all the dialogue just now, so I have like no idea what he just said. Okay, okay, I'm watching I'm watching myself as I was going to talk to the statue. Okay, yeah, because yeah, I was I was basically kind of like clicking through these dialogues a little too fast. I feel like I just missed. Oh, okay, okay. He did like a he did cast like a spell to make the thing happen, and then he said he he gave a hint or something. Uh, shoot. Okay, Paimon says it changed. The tree changed. Okay, that was the one. Come, come on. I'm waiting for I'm waiting for myself to click past this. 
Pass okay, there it is. Uh, okay. Yeah. Break off a... Okay, wait. So he says, break off a branch and put it in the broken jar outside the abode, and the stone gate will open. Okay. Okay, I had to, I had to check on that. I, I I've I've been clicking through this. I've been clicking through the dialogue faster than normal or faster than I normally do. So I just kind of like I completely missed his what he was basically saying. It um it doesn't help that there's like no voice acting behind that um behind this quest. So it's like easy to accidentally click through them. Okay, so I've got the branch. Oh. A luxurious chest. Let's go. Investigate. Okay, so you can go in here. Where am I? And can I go back somehow? Adeptus Repose. Crystal fly. Okay, that's normal. You go. Where are we going? Isa. Where is hold on, where does this lead? You go back in Wait, I'm back in the valley. Oh no, hold on. This is a different spot than we went in, right? Oh here okay. Here's the here's the courtyard. And then here's oh, okay, we're in a different we're different spot, that's why. Okay, 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 I see. And then I got the branch. Oh that's this thing, the ancient tree branch. Okay, wait. I wanna see if there's anything else. Is there anything else to look for inside there? I don't know why I picked him up. I'm retracing my steps. Okay. Down. Grab it. So we got the branch. And then this... Okay, so this was the way to... Oh, I've missed the... I've missed the boat on the free teleport. Was that it? Was that the only thing? It was just to go and investigate? Because didn't... I think... I thought Paimon said something else. Well, like... Some optional thing we could have done. I mean, I think maybe that was the optional thing? Alright, well, let's go. Look for the medicine jar mentioned by the sacred simulacrum. In the other side. Are you on the right spot? He's on a platform. Okay, no, I think he's on the right spot then. Look for the medicine jar. Investigate the medicine jar. Okay, okay. And then we put in the tree branch. The butterflies are going into a back room. It's the back rooms. A chest has been opened. Explore the hidden vault. Is you go here or is that? Oh, there's a platform here. So we should have somebody to to put there. See, I keep. Pressing through these too quickly. <clears throat> okay. I guess it was less important to do that, but... I don't know. It's a bad habit of mine nowadays. I feel like I'm clicking through, which is 
it's it's hurting my ability to enjoy the game because I keep clicking through subconsciously now. Can I put you here? Oh, okay. If you are going to enter Master Study, remember not to touch the stone slate. It is very something very important to master. Say that again. Something about okay, entering. Remember not to touch the stone slate. Okay. <laughs> so this is this must be the yeah. master's study. Is this the stone slate? There's some ancient texts in here. Maybe I take, maybe I grab. Okay, maybe I grab the. Oh, that's it. Oh, just talk. Read the ancient texts. Wait, that was it? I just had to read I just had to read these things? Oh, okay. Nice. Sorry. You cool. Sorry. Please read the UID. Is it too small for you to see? Oh, ancient notes. Wait, what did he say? Deptal sir, akin to new life source. Go west and beyond Ling Shu courtyard and. Or, and behold. Oh no, I think it. Not beyond. I think they said behold. And behold Ling Shu court. Okay, okay, okay. Which was this thing here. Okay. Good. Oh, here it is. I buried a few nice things in the corner of the flower field. In the corner of the flower field. What is the flower field? You cool. Like here? Oh, here. There's the gate. Is it hard to read it there, um, Troy? Are you finding it hard to read in the uh, in the bottom right? Like I don't know. Maybe it's just is it too small? I don't know. You cool. Apparently I finished that side quest. I thought I'd have to do more in terms of investigating the study. I'm surprised all I had to do was like literally go up to a couple of scrolls and then uh, and then just read them for a second. But I guess that works. Shoot. Ah, keep picking this guy up. Okay, are we ready to go then? I guess we could kind of uh, okay, if we can if we can get through this area and then towards the end here, then we can kind of brace the whole region. We can kind of say that like we've explored all of this down towards this area, and then everything is just now contained going upwards from here. 62% on this. Not great, not great, but I'll live with it for now. Check the friend requests. Alrighty. There you go. Oh yeah. I 
I now have 60 out of 60 friends, so I'm gonna have to figure out who to remove <laughs> if, if we uh, if we get more people trying to jump in. Got the big guy out here. There you go. Hit him with blunt force trauma. You cool. Alrighty, alrighty. Got a chest over here. Can't really see. Don't try it. They tried it. Okay. Rock. Oh, there's another cave. Oh, there's another cave in here. Teleport waypoint. Isa. Do we not have a map down here? I'm looking at my mini map, it doesn't hasn't changed yet. Geo. Okay, so two geo monuments. The chest in the back. I guess this is not a very large a very large cave, but. Okay, well I can do that quickly then. Um... Yeah, sure. Dang. Just the two monuments and that's it? Okay. I appreciate easy chests. Does it always storm in Kanazuka? Um, at your current part of the story, yes. Um, once you once you do certain canon events, um, lore related or story related story related events, um, it should it should sort of mellow out. Isa. Yeah, there, there's there's a way there's a way um, that you uh, mellow it out. So, but at the moment, it's gonna be that way, since uh, you're still sort of early in your Inazuma exploration. Okay, there's a waterfall. We open that up. Isa. See you point. Nice. Teleport waypoint, let's go. Spirit carp in the sky. Hold on, where are the other ones? Oh, I hear this one over here. Wait, we put it there. And then who else needs it? Oh, these two. Okay, I'll walk over here. Got it. Nice, nice. And then this thing is way high in the sky above me. Oh, right there. There it is. Um... Oh, here we go. I can make one. Nice. Okay, let's take a good vantage point. 
which is actually kind of nice. You can just like shoot it from that owl in any direction. So now I can literally build my own vantage point. Definitely good exploration tool for sure. There's a challenge here. I don't know what's back there. There's a chest on this hill. Uh, okay. Chest on the hill. Yeah, chest on the hill. Let's go. Out of my way. Isa. Okay, everybody run in. Everybody run in. Get over here, please. Or you know what? Here, fine. I'll, I'll kill these guys first because you're too stubborn to run over here. And then, you know what? I'm, I'm impatient, so you, you'll just die where you stand. Thank you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I couldn't wait. I couldn't wait, man. I told you to come over here. You had a chance. And you didn't get over here. So now you just die where you were. Start the show. Wee. Ah, uh, there. Okay. Wait, did we not? Oh, we got it. We got it. I was wondering for a second. I was like, "There's no way we missed that." Wee. Activate. What is this? Why is there a transport balloon? And why does it look like I can actually go defend it? Put the precious chest. And then let me see if I can defend that transport balloon. Hold up. Like, why are they attacking a transport balloon? And why is it that I have no idea what, what it is? Because, like, it wasn't part of my original objective. Oh, come on, get up. Am I about to miss a cannon event? Up. Why are they randomly attacking this transport balloon? Is this a- oh, I wonder if this is like a, a random event. Maybe it becomes a quest once I- once I finish defending it? No? No, it just straight up- there's just straight up a random transport balloon. I think we start it. Oh yeah. You want Skarmouche or Kazwa? Um I mean I would probably go Scar I would probably I'm sorry, no, not Skarmouche. I would probably go Kazwa. I think I think Scar um, I think Skarmouche, like yeah, he's your He's your standard DPS character. But in terms of in terms of oh, don't fall down. In terms of like being able to use them on a lot of teams, I think um I think Kazo is better for that. Like especially with the crowd control. Right? There's there's more ways to use Kazuha in a team than there is to use um, Skarmouche. Emma, are you still going for Nahida on, on this banner? Or no, or did you... Have you gotten Nahida yet? Or no, you, I know you, because I know you got the Cloud Retainer. Mm. 
Oh, three chests for that? What? Okay. Three chests for this. I'll take it. I'll take it. Give me all that stuff. Okay, that was worth. That was worth it. Nice. Troy, what language do I play on? Um, I'm playing on English. I am able to read the words. Um, if you're... I assume I'm I'm pretty sure you're asking about the voice. Uh, I'm playing on Japanese voice. So yeah, so I have the game in English, so I can actually I can actually play it without um, being unable to understand what's going on. Um, and then just the just the the voices I'm using Japanese. Teleport waypoint. I probably have to. Oh, I have to probably go back down there. Isa, you go. What's up, boys? Isa, you go. Emma, you found a new character that you want? Okay, lay it on me. Who do, who do, I was gonna say, who do we want? Because it's, you know, stream courtesy, stream etiquette, but. Oh, you want Kokomi. Okay, okay. Valid, valid selection. Valid selection. Is it because you've been seeing me use Kokomi or? <laughs> Where is this thing? Oh, it's right there. Oh, you just say her power makes raided soldiers run away? Oh. <laughs> Nice, nice. Um, Troy, I be Troy, I believe so. I think it's supposed Lantern Right should be coming um, February fifth. I believe, if I'm not mistaken, I think it's February fifth, and it is February fourth today. So, yes, it is. It, I believe it's getting close to launching. <laughs> Oh, and then we can also claim commission rewards too. Isa. You cool. Isa. You cool. Sick. Yeah, so it should be basically very soon. I mean, okay, here's the thing. Um it's launching very soon am i gonna play it on the first day probably not i'm probably gonna wait a little bit before i start playing um lantern right just because like you know it's gonna be it's gonna be in segments right like every every event is gonna have like stages right so if i have to like if i play it right on the first day then i can only go like maybe a little bit of the way into it and then it's just like oh wait for two more days and then the next stage opens up so to make it more continuous you know I figure it might be easier to just wait a little bit after it releases hmm. troy what character am i saving up for um i want yai miko <laughs> And I know Yaimiko's coming up Isa. in the next one, or in the next phase. Um, now, that being said, I would be okay with getting Cloud Retainer. Like, I'm not, I'm not going to like really, you know, 
I'm, I'm, I'm not feeling like, oh, I really want, I really want Cloud Retainer. You know, make sure I don't lose out on that. What did he say? Move the waterfall, what? Move the waterfall. Floating storm platform, maintain the perfection of order and balance. Floating storm platform? Move the waterfall above me, away. You Will I pull for Yai on stream? Probably. <laughs> Yeah, I could, I could, I could probably do that. You cool. If we want to, if we want to do that, yeah, we could, I could probably, uh, I could probably pull for on stream. Oh my god. I mean, I did one for, I did that for like Hu Tao. Wait, can I put this somewhere? Oh, shoot, I collected it. What do I do with it? Ah, okay. Okay, so I gotta move this somewhere. Oh, I can put it here. Ooh. Nice. Ballast is restored to both sides of the stone platform. Isa. Oh, and then I put it here. Spirit orb. Wait, where is this coming from? What are we collecting? Carp Spirit Orb. <laughs> Emma, where is Watatsumi Island? I feel like... I feel like I want to tell you... But I also don't want to ruin your experience by like. <laughs> I, I feel like I think you encounter Watatsumi Island just as part of the um, as part of like the story, so. <laughs> yeah, Inazuma. Well, you know, as you probably you probably know already, Inazuma is based on Japan, right? So, Japan is an archipelago. It's like a bunch of islands. So, you know, gotta gotta work through the islands. <clears throat> uh, Troy, what do I have for the new area? Percentage wise, I'm at 62 on this upper section. I have 48 on this lower section, and I haven't even discovered this part yet. So, don't tell me. Don't tell me. I'm just, I'm just making my way through it. <laughs> I'm I'm very into uh, I'm very into experiencing things in Genshin Impact. So, I yeah I like I really for for myself I really try to avoid like spoilers in Genshin. Can you tell? Good thing I have so much freaking stamina. Holy crap. No. Oh my god. Yeah, that's totally fine. Nice. Give me my spirit carp. Emma, you're zooming. Noise, noise. Zoom, zoom around that place. Get, get all over that place. Okay, now that I have the teleport waypoint, now I can explore down here, just to make sure I didn't lose anything. Sandbear wood? Where is this taking me? It's taking me underground. At least under the ground where I am. More chests down here. Ooh, there's a thing here. Oh, this thing inside. Place me by the banks of the pond so I may gaze out and admire the lovely lotuses. <laughs> I 
beach the boat. Je okay, one thing I find with the boat in Genshin, you generally can get out of a beach. Like, if you beach it, you can, um, you, you, you actually can, like, back up out of it. So you're not, you generally don't get, like, 100% stuck. So, try to, like, see if you can, like, back up out of the beach. Because generally it's, like, um, if you back up, in, like, in the exact opposite direction as you went in, normally you can actually get out of it. <clears throat> oh, it opened. Let's go. Isa. Return me to my friends beside the lotus pond. I can do that. Yuko. Got completely on top of a small. Oh. <laughs> Promise with two friends to gaze upon the lotus landscape together. Oh, I can't even collect them anymore. Okay. So that means okay. That then then that has to be the right place then. It's not telling me. If it's not giving me the prompt to take him off, then yeah, probably must be a thing here. Oh, cool! I can actually zoom upwards. Take a look. I did the waterfall down here. Is that everything? There's a thing in the sky here. We could probably get that a little later. <clears throat> oh, okay, that lily pad that lily pad is completely is completely phased through. Literally does not exist. Very comfortable. Oh, oh, I see that. I see the third guy. Shoot, hold on. Yeah, he's being stomped by this guy here. Oh shoot, I'm using the wrong person. Oh, whatever. Geo's not a bad idea. That's yeah, not terrible. It wasn't who I was expecting, but... I guess Albedo could suffice. Grab this. Makes sense, that's your average ability pad. Yeah, I guess, I mean, with the weight of a person, I suppose it would, you would fall through for sure. Is it here? Yes, okay, it is. The precious chest has been claimed. Let's go. Okay, now let's take this teleport weapon up so I can actually see up here. Jeez. Isa. Spirit carp. Oh, it's up there. You cool. On top of the gazebo. How do I get on top of the gazebo? I love it. It's actually kind of, it's actually kind of, kind of nice. You can kind of cheese everything. All you gotta do is like point up and then glide the rest of the way. Without ever trying to get somewhere. Okay. Uh, that's the waypoint. I don't need to sit and drink tea, right? I can sit, but I don't need to drink tea. Yeah, we're fine. 
風の流れる方へしっ行こうしっ風の行く先よ There should be more islands in there, right? Yeah, okay. You can kind of go this way. <laughs> Emma, you ran away from everything. <laughs> nice, nice. Whatever, whatever it takes to stay safe, right? Prevent the death. You cool. I thought there was something in that tree for a second. Get the top. Spirit carp on my right. Oh, and then this thing also gives me jump height. Okay, for the spirit carp, I'm just gonna like. Right about here on the mini. So it's I'm right on top of it on the mini map. And then just drop. If it's meant to be, I should be hitting it on the way down. Okay. Um so I think we're good to here. And then we just did like the I guess the islands in the sky. I don't know if we got all of them, but I mean, I guess that's okay for now. Hey. Okay, oh, and then there's some of this. I don't even know if it's like withering or. Break him! Break him! Hold on, who's the ringleader? Oh, it's the green guy. Yeah, but you're the captain. You're the captain of the Tatsumi Island. I think you're, you're. Well, I don't know if you're captain of the Tatsumi Island. You're more a. Um, what is it? I think you're you're like you call the acting captain of of a of a unit, right? You're the acting captain of a particular mi military unit. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. For yeah, yeah. The acting captain for Swordfish Two or something like that. Yeah. They're a particular like special forces unit or something. <laughs> I mean, okay, yeah, if we think about it that way, everyone who played Genshin Impact and did that quest is technically captain of, uh, of Swordfish too. That's true, that's true. You. Emma, you are the best. <laughs> I'm not going to endorse anybody here to keep it fair. Ooh. Don't forget to do your logins, people. Okay. Couple more furnishings to claim. Or blueprints to play. claim. That's still looking at the daily rewards. Okay. Uh did that clean us out? You cool. I mean it might clean us out in terms of this Isa. corner. Cause I think that it looked like that was the only thing they had in that cave. I think when we aren't in Anazuma, they make another traveler as the captain. Probably. I mean, I think. 
I think after the um after the story quest oh, whoops after the Archon story that like made you serve as the captain of Swordfish 2 I think in general you were like only put there as like an honorary position right so Isa. Oh shoot, I didn't mean to go into this guy, but all right. Ah, damn it. I didn't mean to shoot out. Man, okay. Oh my god. Set it down here. Okay, there we go. Put it straight out. And then you're gonna call it. Oh, there's more there. Oh, there's two more. Okay, okay. You call. Isa. There's two more over this side. Oh my god, stop climbing! Okay, okay, okay. I need to put one here. I need to put one there, and I guess right here. Okay, get out. Got it. So I guess, yeah, they don't have to be on at the same time. They just have to be on at similar time. Hmm. Here. Oh my god. I keep slip sliding away into the wrong place. Alright. Drop on this. Where is the thing that. Okay. Oh, it changed the position after you have the hairpin with our double energy. Where do I put it? Can I put it somewhere? Or I just let it, let it go? Jade Cascade. Should we move the Jade Hairpin she left behind? second let's do some housekeeping make sure we you know we can't we can't regress we want to push forward into the new stuff but gotta make sure we're still protecting our work back home 
back where we know. Actually, uh, I don't even really need to do commissions, right? I can just kind of, from all the chests we've been opening, I guess that just kind of does it for us. So we just claim it. 240, 40 primos. Yeah. I go to a adventurer's guild, claim the extra reward from completing the commissions. Nice. resin we have 90 okay so we go after town materials easy enough which town materials that's the, that's the hard part okay which one did I want to grind for we're at the we're at the talent book domain. Well, they're getting from Mafia for Farina. Wait, where was my logic on this? I'm trying to I'm trying to re-piece the logic that I was using to get to this junction. Is it for Navia? Because, yeah, these are both. I mean, it's talent books here. I don't know what it is. I must have gone here for a reason. I can't think of it. to use a little bit of resin so that we could use up the 90 there a little bit more. I don't know why I got to choose this. Why did I choose that? I mean, I guess. I, mean, I guess Navi and Farina could both use it. I'd have to split it across the two different, I guess, I guess, missions. Who do we bring in? Where's my Kokomi? Just to keep us alive. This first one is gonna be kind of scuffed because we don't have all these ultimates okay. set up and ready to go. Trying to get all the ultimates charged for the next couple runs. Okay. Using condensed resin for it. I don't even know how many runs I was going to do of this. Oh, 
Oh my god. Troy, something's wrong with your Twitch chat? Okay, well. I mean, that's why we've got multiple that's why we've got multiple platforms. So you can work on different areas. Or use something else to get to get the chat out. Um what are we doing? I'm taking a quick break from uh, from exploring the new place. And then just trying to do some of this um trying to do some of this I guess housekeeping tasks. Whatnot. Uh, I'm not sure if there's something wrong, Emma. Troy is telling me they're having problems um, with their Twitch chat, I guess. Maybe sending messages or whatever. Um, so they've moved back to the YouTube. But hey, that's fine. This is, this is why we have multiple platforms. If there's something going on, you know, we, we got options. We got options. If you spell Ayaka without the last A, it will be true. Like, Ayaka? Okay, I didn't know it would stop me. I don't, I don't think I have that as a, a Twitch rule. I, I think there's, there's some, there's probably some setting somewhere in a deep dark corner that says like, you can customize words or phrases that you can chat. I don't think I have any of those. But... Okay. That's probably enough to disturb me. Okay. Uh, let's go crafting. Make two more of those. Just, yeah, use up the rest of it. Or make as many as we can. At least it doesn't give the hassle about, about using it. Troy, who are we farming for? Or what are we farming for? Um... I kind of got into the domain that are used for talents. Um, so like the, the ones that give out like these books that I can use for leveling up either Navia or um, Farina, right? Cause they take this one here. And then I know Farina takes a different one. She uses more of the sword, that little sword there. They should have the traveler have different outfits for each place you visit. That would be kind of cool, yeah. I mean, maybe not unlock it like right at the beginning of each Archon quest, because like you know, part of part of that introduction to the Archon quest uh, introduces your character entering the uh, country as a foreigner. But I guess maybe by the end of the quest, it wouldn't hurt to have uh, some form of. Blended in clothing with them. I mean, even without that, you know, even without the alternate skins, they're still being noticed. We're still being noticed as a foreigner. And then I, I don't know. I guess the lore-wise, we're technically not even of this world. Um Hmm. 
I guess the other thing I might want to think about is, do we want to do some Spiral Abyss tonight? I haven't done any yet, so. I mean, I, okay, if we, even if we do, I wouldn't, you know, definitely we're not expecting to go 36 stars in one go. Um, I might not even get 36 stars tonight. Um, just because, like, the, the enemies in there are, like, annoyingly difficult. Or not even, not even, like, difficult in terms of, um, staying alive. It's more of just, like, difficult to, to do efficiently. Just because, like, they waste a lot of time. Just the way they, the way they move wastes a lot of time in the fight. Hmm. I don't know. Thinking of thinking of what to do with some of the some of the housekeeping stuff. We should probably you know, do that as well. Troy, you want to see us do spiral tonight? Okay, okay. That's one vote. I mean, I feel like. I feel like Emma, Emma, you're probably just gonna say like, do whatever you want. <laughs> I feel like that that sounds like something you'd say. I don't know. Do you have a, uh, a take on this? Yeah. <laughs> yep. Okay. Cool. You cool. You. I do me. All right. All right. get rid of these quests off of my screen. Just for my own peace of mind. You know, not have them glaring at me. Making me think I've miss, missed out on doing stuff. I think it's only, well, I guess they've only changed in like, I guess, 11 and 12 maybe? I'm not sure, I think 10 might be about the same. Yeah, even if I've already gotten like um, a bunch of chests that day and just you know, I could skip these in terms of in terms of Primo gems, I could just skip all of these commissions. But you know, I feel like I feel like I gotta I gotta at least try to progress certain commission storylines so if you're lucky sometimes there's uh there are achievements attached to some of these commissions so you know do do a variety of the commissions and in in a variety of places so it's always been my experience As Ask him questions. I feel like I haven't done this part of this quest of this commission quest line. Cause sometimes they have like they have like a quest line for commissions even that like you have like a similar follow-up 
commission based on the one from the day before. And then if you complete the whole chain of related commission quests, like one per, one per day, right? Like the continuation would happen the next day. Then it's like, sometimes you hit an achievement. Remember to add enough fuel to really heat the fire. Take it out to process it. Hammer it from the inside out. You cool? I already missed the first instruction. Shoot. I don't even remember what the first instruction said. Tajuous tricks, process the gear, uh, add more fuel. I think to really, yeah, he says get the fire going. And then. Middle and work way out to the edges, inside out. Nice. Okay, so I yeah, actually this looks like this looks like the the last part of a particular commission quest line actually. All right. Um, let's see here. Troy, some of the shops in Anazma don't let you buy things. I think I know which one you're talking about. I'm going to I'm going to go to an Anazima shop and you're gonna tell me if that's one of the ones that are not letting you do anything. Are you talking about this one here? I'm too far. But can I get a little closer? Oh no, this is right. Are you talking about this shop? I I, I have a feeling I f I have a feeling you're talking about this shop. Right, and and if it is this shop then yeah then yeah there's a very there's a very solid reason as to why it doesn't um get any get doesn't let you get anything from it the diamond one okay cool so it is this one um yeah okay so starting from inazuma and forward so inazuma has this Sumeru has this, and um, and Fontaine has this as well. So, what happens from Inazuma forward is now okay. So you already know about the diamond one, right? Um, what you're looking for is you have these sigils, right? You you do you get chests from that place and you get sigils, right? And then you spend the sigils at these shops, these diamond shops, right? So, the thing is, for Mondstadt and Lyra, right, these are pretty simple, right? You just go to the diamond shop and then you can buy whatever you want, right? I mean, it's the same thing here too, right? There is, you know, there are things to, there are things to buy here. Um, but, um, there is one catch. There is a catch, um that, in, again, Anazuma, Sumeru, and Fontaine are all going to have this catch. So, the reason they stop, the reason they don't let you buy anything is that there's another place to put your sigils right now. So when you land in Anazuma or Sumeru or Fontaine, right, you get your sigils and stuff. Yes, this shop takes sigils, but they're normally nowadays there normally is another place to put your sigils 
Case in point. The shrine. So in Inazuma, your, I guess, secondary sigil consumer is the Sakura tree up at the shrine. So if you go all the way up to the Isa. shrine, right, you have different, I guess, um, you have different rewards that you can get out of it, right? And it, it's good stuff, right? So this is the other place that you put your sigils into. So in a way, what Genshin does is that they say, okay, well, the stuff in the shop, it's okay, but it's not great stuff, right? right. If you had to choose between these rewards and the ones in the shop, you would probably want these rewards. Right, they, these are really good rewards. Um, and so when they don't let you buy stuff from the shop in Anazuma, it's basically Hoyo versus way of like warning you or stopping you like, hey, you know, instead of using your sigils here, you should use them here at the tree, right? And get your stuff, get your stuff uh, leveled up in here, right? Once you get level 50, once you finish this and you get level 50, right? And it, it tells you right there too, right? As soon as you get level 50, you get the, you get the shop opened up. Right. So the shop that you can't buy anything at right now, when you get to level 50 here, then it opens up and you can start buying stuff in the shop. But they're basically they basically stop you from doing it at the very beginning because they want you to prioritize here. So. Yeah, of course, of course, Troy. Yeah, that makes sense for sure. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, so for Inazuma, you it's it's the tree. So you gotta you gotta basically complete the whole tree, and then you can and then you can open the diamond shop. Yeah, I I should I should, but the only reason I'm holding on to it is because actually you know what that yeah that reminds me yeah so you you actually know something about it too so yeah because Fontan Fontan you can't open the diamond shop until you finish up the fountain right the fountain is where you put your sigils for now um the reason i keep them right now is because i know i cannot hit maximum level right i have 269 in order for me to hit max level on the fontaine fountain i need 300 right because i think what level am i at right now I'm pretty sure I'm around 44. Right? Or I'm at 40. I'm at 40. I'm at level 40. So each level takes 30, right? If I if I throw all of them in right now, I'm getting 8 levels. Right? And so I just want to, I'm, I'm waiting until I get enough sigils, so then I can go from like 40 to 50 all together. I don't know. Well, I don't know, would it stop me at 45 or... Because I just, yeah, I, I, I like the feeling of being able to just spend it all at once, right? If I can jump from 40 to 50, it'd be, it's a nice feeling, it's a nice feeling. So I'm waiting until I can hit like maybe 300. Or, it, sorry, it is 300. Um, I'm waiting to see if I can get to 300 for the Hydro Sigils, and then I spend them. You did it as soon as you unlocked the fountain and got it to level 4. Hey, you know what? There's two different, there's two different types of players. There's two different types of players. It's either... Every time you get sigils, you want to throw them in right away and then get the instant progress, which makes sense. You know, that happens. And then the second type of player, me, or anyone like me, I like to I like to hold on to it and then I like to just grab everything all at once. You cool. It it feels it feels satisfying when like I have everything, 
I throw it all in, and bang. All the rewards from, like, 1 to 50. I mean, okay, me, this is one's not, this is not 1 to 50, but, you know, 40 to 50, I'm thinking. Yeah, because I could do it right now, but it's just going to give me, like, to 48. And then I have to, like, you know, come back to it later on and do 49, then do 50. I don't know. It feels, it kind of feels like it's, like, broken up too much. I want to be able to, uh, have it all together. Or try to, try to, try to put, try to submit everything all at the same time. Okay, so 62 and 54 is where we're at right now. <clears throat> and we have one vote for Spiral and one vote for anything. So I guess we'll do Spiral. Or at least starts with Spiral. I don't know. I mean, I'll probably at least do a run through maybe of everything. I'm just worried about um, sort of like some of these, the Wii nut, like this, the second half here and the second half here. These are pretty annoying. Actually, even the Drake is pretty annoying. For the Millers and, so Millers and Sword on Navi, which, which of them do you need to help? Um, I'm pretty sure there's somewhere in here. Like, just kind of walk through... Um, walk through the village in here. Right, walk through the village in, in this area. And then you'll probably, you'll generally find some people. And then I don't know if they're all quests. Some of them are just like collect parts and then give it to them. I mean, the thing is, I don't even know if I've done all of them. Right? They just say like, based on how many you've helped, you get like an extra 24% attack. I, I don't even know if I've got all of them. So. Like, I've, I've helped like... A, I've helped a fair number of them, I think, um, if I remember correctly. I just don't know. I, I don't know if that's all of them, right? Sometimes it's more than you would expect. Okay. Uh... What's that? What is that music? Did it just kind of like... Was there like a boom? That sounded like a boom or something. What the heck? What? Did anybody else hear that? It was like a, it was like a, like this, this ominous sort of background noise. And then there was like a, a, a sort of a, a hit of something. I don't know. Hmm. Okay. <clears throat> Troy, you have the Kazua sword that I have. Okay, yeah. Yeah, it's a pretty easy sword to get. It's just Iron Sting from the uh, the blacksmith. After a character triggers Vaporize, the Vaporize reaction, it increased by 50. Real talk, I probably don't have to think too much about this. I mean, these are pretty easy enemies. And, and it's also floor 9, so I probably don't have to think too hard. There we go. Troy, you still gotta spend today's resin? And yeah, you heard it. Okay, cool. I'm not crazy. I'm not crazy. I might say some where I, I might I might get really tired and my my brain might make me say random stuff on stream that is that makes me sound insane, but I I I'm not crazy. Okay? Even though I might sound it. 
some 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 nights I get really tired on stream and I you know I start to sound delirious but I'm not I'm not crazy <clears throat> Emma you're insane <laughs> Troy I do have uh yeah my iron my iron sting is at r5 um my eula is sort of built um Her build is not bad, but it's not using the artifact set that I want her to. Um, I want her to be running a four-piece Pale Flame set for the physical damage bonus. I currently have a four-piece Gladiator set. So, which is okay, because it, it increases attack and, and sort of... Um, you know, the damage for, like, a physical sword user type of thing. Um, but I do... I, I am still trying to get her a Pale Flame set. A four-piece Pale Flame set. That's going to really up the ante with her physical damage. So she's kind of built. She's kind of built. I think she's on, what, 40 crit rate on 217? 40 on 217? Something like that. Um, so she's okay. She's okay. Uh, the best I've hit with her... With her is like 439,000. So, yeah, it's not bad, but definitely not fully built, I guess. Not as fully built as I might like it to be. We need fire in here. Okay, fire. <laughs> Emma, I was about to recite that actually. I, oh man. Because I, we were talking about the crazy and insanity and stuff like that. I was actually about to say something about that. It's going to be like, crazy? I was crazy once. They locked me in a room. A rubber room. A rubber room with rats. <laughs> crazy? I was crazy once. Sorry. All right. Sorry. I uh, I won't do any more than that. Okay. We might need Kokomi just for like healing in general. <clears throat> didn't eula rerun last year she did do a rerun um it was right before i'll hate them i think <clears throat> emma how late do i think i'm gonna stream tonight um i'm thinking maybe half an hour to an hour i don't think i'll go straight to four o'clock AKA, um, maybe not straight to six o'clock. Um, like I, I'm not going to lie. There's been a couple points in the stream tonight so far that I think I, I probably said some pretty weird things. Like it, maybe you might've heard it and be like, what, what, how, how does that make any sense? That's not relevant to what you were just saying. That might just be me getting to really, really tired and <laughs> starting to say random stuff. Um, there's my, that's my crazy part, but... I mean, now that we're doing, now that we're doing a uh, spiral of this, I'll probably be on for a little while. At least a little while. Especially to give it to a good old college try, you know? Yeah, if I'm gonna be giving this the good old college try, then I'll be on for a at least a little while. <laughs> Okay, floor nine should be pretty trivial. I don't think we'll. I'd be I'd be pretty surprised if we had like any major major problems with it. Oh my god! I got frozen. Yo, 
よし出発だはあ風だみんなは俺が守る燃えろここだよ。I might have done a couple things on the stream where I was like, I, was, I did it out of like extreme fatigue and tiredness. And then.、Um, what's it called? And then I just kind of tried to like finish my sentence. But then I just end up saying something you know, irrelevant or whatever. I don't know. Okay, those guys were too far. Can I get this? Oh, I'm close enough to hit him. Nice, nice. I have no stamina. What? No good. We just made it out of her little trap. There we go. Troy, you played one game of Call of Duty two hours ago? Okay. I mean, you don't have to be crazy good at the game to play it, right? I mean, okay, I might be a little hypocritical about that too. Sometimes I don't like to play because I'm not that great at it. But,、um, I mean, hey, at least you gave it a try. And that's all you can ask for.、Though. Holy crap. Jeez, what? Okay. This bot is doing way too much damage. I mean, it didn't matter because we ended up you know, running a train through them afterwards, but we're good, we're good. Okay, 50 increased damage. To opponents affected by Hydro, who do we have? Okay, that's not bad. Hmm. With those guys, though. Ruin Grader. Okay, we could probably, we could probably live with that. We go one, two, one, two. And then over here we go. Where is it? A couple of guys here. Okay. I mean, it could just be easy to do like that, right? Meh, might as well. I'm using all of my crowd control people on one team, so. Go! Right here. Nice, nice. Alright, we take that. Yeah, we'll just kind of do the big rise here for the rest of it. Oh shoot, I went too fast. My bad. I was still trying to press circle to do the attacks, and so I accidentally backed out. We're good, we're back, we're back. 
Uh, recharge. Shoot, do I have my ultimate? I don't have my ultimate. Alright. Uh, I can kind of pull them in. That's fine. Do that. Um, do you need to? I could probably hold on. I was gonna use Venti for the, uh, for the burst. I can probably hold on. But... There we go. I guess... Hmm, now that I think about it, speaking about Call of Duty, I actually did manage to get a... Um, today I basically uh, did some grinding on the zombies mode. And I did get the... Um, Emma, you might know this. So I got the... Um, what is it? The, uh, the, the Northern Lights cap. After all that grinding, I finally got the, uh, the Northern Lights. So I can put that on now. So that's new. I don't know. In, in Call of Duty. Yep, yep. I think Call of Duty, they're also, um, they're also adding a new season in like a couple, or the next season is coming out in a couple days too, so I'll have to go between Genshin and that. That'll be something I have to worry about. Almost done with floor 10 here. Is there only two of them? Yeah, there's only two. Okay, that's easy enough. Okay, floor 10. A Nemo damage bonus. Okay, Blazing Axe, Geo Vyshap, Pyro Cryo. Oh, okay. Hmm. Mirror Maiden. Okay, so basically the team from here Pyro and Cryo. Okay. I just have to be careful to make sure that the Cryo Abyss Mage goes down or gets hit with some fire stuff. Oh, and then, oh, well, I guess there is the Hydro Slime there. Hmm. I guess Kazuo can probably take care of that, right? A Nemo damage bonus. I mean, can we do it without having to do... We might be able to just squeeze by with this team. I mean, I feel like, yeah, the, those enemies aren't too difficult to beat. We might be able to squeeze by with these teams. <clears throat> Energy recharge. <laughs> do, wait, do green force count as damage against me? What the heck? God, I can't move. Jeez. Oh, 
I'm gonna have to be really careful with the next round. We need 60% health left over. We're already at like, what, 70 something? Okay. We're gonna hit the challenge, and then we're gonna go out, and then we're actually gonna bring them to the thing. Because if they're being swirled there, they can't really do any damage. Because right, they're being picked up into the air. So we might be able to get by with it. And there's no time limit for this because we're just needing to uh, keep it alive. Yeah, okay. That was good enough to cheese it. Burst damage. Don't even need to think. Burst damage. <laughs> Sorry, I uh, I I laughed because um, of the comment that was made. Um, <laughs> I know I know Emma, you can't see the uh, the comment that was made on YouTube, but Troy literally said the exact same thing. Well, he, he said that was smart AF, and then, and then you just said that was smart. <laughs> you got a uh, very in sync, in sync chat tonight. I probably need. I probably do need first. Yeah. I need a little more speed. I guess so. I guess so. Yeah, Troy, you got that right. Yeah. Oh shoot! I got to the five-minute mark to get three stars. Oh, wait. Oh, I have five minutes to get three stars. Oh, yeah. Oh, I don't have to be done in seven minutes. Okay, okay. <laughs> I just I just looked at the side and I realized I can I can wait and I can complete it when there's like five minutes on the clock left over. I'm too used to floor 12. Everything is always seven minutes left on the clock. I actually have two extra minutes. Okay, okay. <laughs> Take a slip. Wait, this one's kind of good. Okay, I thought they would. I thought they would be coming out together at the same time. Okay, that's fine. Okay, yeah. that works. Oh yeah, floor twelve is definitely. Hard. I think, especially with the um, with the way they set it up this round. Um, I actually had a couple friends who also play Genshin IRL, um, or they don't play Genshin IRL, but they they're IRL people I know that play Genshin. Um, and then he, like, even they were saying that, like, yeah, um, floor 12 right now is kind of terrible because of the fact that, um, well, you'll see, you'll see, there's, um, there's the, there's, like, two different sort of worm-shaped creatures, but, like, the problem is that, like, with floor 12, it's always about time, right? You always want to finish the thing with, like, seven minutes left over on the clock. Both of those bosses on, on 12-1 and 12-2 those uh worm shaped creatures they tend to go underground for extended periods of time so basically you have small windows to like absolutely unload the damage on them which is which makes it pretty difficult sometimes to to you know take them down as fast as necessary for it 
Come here. Can I can I bring the other guy in? Bro? The other guy's not coming. Oh, he is coming. I'm gonna want to use this. Oh my gosh, she's almost dead. Oh, that's okay. we, we got time, we got time. We can make it. Right? We can make it. Okay. Well, I mean, if our if our if our person that's literally built specifically for shielding is doing forty four thousand damage, we're probably okay. Go. 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 Down. Buff. Damage. Rupin. Out. Up. Down. Summon. We have a couple more people we have to fight after this, too. One. Wait. Wait, who am I? Who's the last person? I got one minute. Oh, there it is. Stop running. Stop resisting. She stopped resisting. Alright. Uh okay. So how I'm going to how I'm going to target this is I'm going to try to create a team that is going to be the best possible for the characters on this chamber. I'm going to completely disregard chamber two and chamber three. Troy, what does Kazuha's alt do? Um, you basically have it. Um, he does the slash at the beginning and then um, within that circle, um, every, every couple seconds, um, it, it does another hit. It swirls around inside of it. Also, I cannot revive uh, Yoinia because um, you can't use food inside the spiral of this. So if a person dies, they're dead. For that for that stage, um, at least. Or they're dead for the floor. But because, I mean, it was 11-3, right? So, you know. We can, I mean... We're going into floor twelve, right? I can use I can use Yoimiya again. She'll be she'll be um, automatically healed. Yeah, but if a character dies in, in on a floor, they're dead for the rest of the floor. If you if you continue with it, if you do a retry, then obviously you get you know they they get re healed back again. Um, okay. So as I was saying, I'm gonna basically try to treat this as if there's no chamber two and there's no chamber three. I need the absolute best team I can get for chamber one. So that's how, that's how I'm gonna target it. Um, I think we're going to need. This is the team I normally use for the for the snake. So I'm gonna try to do that, and then who do we use for this? I mean, honestly, these two are good. And then, ooh, hmm. Maybe this? That's, that's doable. With like fire. Yeah, okay. Yeah, that's doable. I'm gonna try that out. 
Uh, let's see. <laughs> you hate the preacher has got too much HP. Hey, man. <laughs> Try 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 finding preacher at twelve one. <laughs> Let's go. Skill damage. Definitely, I think yeah, we definitely want skill damage for. And then Farina's thing is gonna do a lot more damage that way. It's too bad I can't switch that character before I start. I just I have to switch it right after. Go. <laughs> Um, we might be able to just go with this for... I don't like that. Yeah, that's so much water. Not great. Oh, I have no stamina. Is that enough to go? Okay. Now we got these guys. Okay, okay, we're... Actually, this is not bad. Oh boy. Hold on. Get that to him again. The healing. Okay, and then back to this one. Oh my god, I'm getting pushed back. There we go. <clears throat> Kokomiya support doing main DPS. Yeah. <laughs> I am. Um, what's it called? The way I had it set up, um, like honestly, she's not. She's actually not bad for DPS. She really is not that bad for DPS. Um, and then especially because I put on um, Farina, right? When Farina does her burst, she gains those fanfare stacks, right? And then so that's gonna buff um, Kokomi's damage a lot. Right? And the best part is because Farina is. Pulling down, pulling everyone's health down, and then Kokomi is putting everyone's health up, and then to get more, and then the um, Farina's buff depends on how many times do people's health go down and go up. So, <clears throat> yeah. So with Kokomi, right? I think my best I've ever done is probably like somewhere between eleven and twelve thousand with a normal attack. Right, and the fact that it's on a normal attack makes it like pretty good because of how long the burst is going to last. So, by the end of the burst, you've probably done a good couple hundred thousand if you're going, um, you know, if you're going strong the whole time. Yeah, I mean, okay, the negative crit rate is the negative crit rate, um, is just a thing, yeah, that they gave her. I mean, which. I guess makes sense because if if she could crit, if if Kokomi could crit and she was doing that much damage on normal attacks, right? You've got to you've got to remember that she's her her damage is coming from normal attacks. If her normal attacks are critting, right? Imagine how fast you can do a normal attack versus like a skill or a charged attack, right? The fact that it's normal attacks would make her broken if she could crit. She'd be so crazy good. So I think they had to make sure, they had to try to make her not crit, so that, you know, it wouldn't be so, or as broken. Farina's ult, um, basically with Farina's ult, what happens is you have this thing called fanfare, right? You, you have this effect called fanfare, and what fanfare does is that it gives you a damage bonus, right? And to, to get more fanfare, your health has to go down or your health has to go up, right? It doesn't matter which way, it just, your health has to change, right? So it's not like you are you take no damage or, you know, um, 
the, the whole point of the, of the fanfare thing is that your health needs to change. The number, the amount of health you have has to change. And you want it to change really fast. You know, you want it to go up and down very quickly, right? And the way I have it set up is because Farina brings it down, Kokomi brings it up, right? And so because they're going, because, right, because it's going so quickly, then my fanfare is building up a lot, re relatively fast. And when her fanfare is really high, that's why, so you're, that's why you see, um, that's why you see Kokomi doing like 11,000, 12,000 on normal attack. So. It's interesting. So that's a, that's basically the pairing I've been really enjoying, is putting Kokomi and Farina together. Just for that quick flux of the health going up and down. Oh, I forgot. Right, it's this. No, don't go under the don't go underground. Oh, and he's doing this thing. This is a big time waster. Whatever they do, whenever he does this move, it's, it's a huge time waste. I'll get to your question in a little bit. Um, sorry. Right now I'm trying to concentrate. Seconds. Oh my god, stop climbing. Oh no, he's underground. Ah, I'm close. I didn't make it though. Let me try it. Let me try it. <clears throat> okay, but the skill damage is good. I think the skill damage is probably the right thing to do. Uh, okay, sorry. I can't. I can't check my character, so I can't really read it to you. Um, Nihita's burst. Um, you have to know about her skill to know what her burst does. Um, the skill marks targets and does damage to them. Um, and and you can mark a lot of people at the same time, so a lot of people can take damage at the same time. Um, I'm trying to boil this down for you because I can't really, I can't show you the whole paragraph right now because I'm inside Spiral Abyss. Um, in short, again, Nikita, so Nikita's skill marks targets, does damage. The burst, very, you know, at a high level, the burst says, do you have a hydro character? Do you have a pyro character? Do you have an electro character with you right now? If you have a hydro character, then the, the big dome um, stays longer. If you have a pyro character, then when your skill does damage, it's a bigger number. If you have an electro character, if you if you have an electro character, then the skill does damage more often. So press rat price rep analog state in. I have that mapped to my wish system. I have that on my wish system right now, so. Yeah, yeah, you can change you can change what the uh, what it is or what this map there. Oi. 
逃げ道はありませんこの,ままのクリエイターズ・ 
crit rate, crit damage. Defense. Okay, the crit damage went up. Attack goes up. The fact that they're flat stats, they're not percentage stats, is probably not great. Hmm. Maybe we'll leave it at that. I don't know. I'm not sure how, how if I'll take that any farther. This might be interesting. Crit damage goes up. Crit damage goes up. Okay, okay. Turn it into a W artifact. Okay, Elemental Master went up. That's not too bad. Yeah, that's a, actually that's not a that's a decent that's a decent one. <clears throat> Troy, when the Primos leave, you get a Yalan charge shot. Oh, okay. I wasn't aware that would happen. Hmm. Ah, defense went up. Crit damage went up. Crit damage went up, okay. All right, let's start putting some stuff in here. Mm. It's a bit of a gamble. <laughs> oh, okay. I see the. I see what you mean by the reference. I see what you got. I see what you mean, Troy. Okay, yeah, the Yalan charge shot. Nice. I guess, well, that would be anybody with a, um, wouldn't that be kind of anybody with a hydro charge attack? I mean, I guess maybe she has like a little bit of extra effect on, on a, on her breakthrough shot. Maybe, I don't know. Uh, get that. Oh. Start with that. Then I need to take a couple more. Defense. Mm. Okay. Possible. Possible. If we get a crit rate, if we can get a crit rate spec on the plus twenty, that would be good. That's a lot of HP. Twitch chat is working again. Hey, good to see you again, Troy, on Twitch. The Twitch Troy? I don't know. Hydro damage bonus with crit rate. Danger damage bonus with that. All these stats are all over the place. You can watch while playing mobile Genshin. <laughs> cool, cool. We do I have it sorted in a certain way? I don't even know. 
What is it? How is it sorting it? Is it just by just randomly? What? I guess it's just sorting by the uh, the type of or the, the the artifact set that it's coming from. I guess all these gladiator ones I don't have to worry too too much about. Not many people actually take the gladiator set stuff. Nineteen. It's a very, it's a very strenuous process of having to do this. I mean, a lot of people will tell me to just use, just um, fuse a bunch of them into like the strong boxes. But honestly, like the way the strong boxes work is that you take a bunch of these artifacts and then you sacrifice a few of them in order to create an artifact of a certain, of a certain type or of a certain set. Um, for me, it doesn't seem like that would be exactly as productive as doing it this way. Like, the, ooh, it's a crit rate spec too. Um, I feel like doing it this way, it's tedious to do it this way, but it might be more efficient, I feel like. Because, right, because strong boxes, you're still going to basically generate a random artifact of that set, right? But then that's basically equivalent to doing the actual domain and then having a random artifact from the set drop. I don't know. Well, hmm. I wonder if artifact strong boxes can actually target the slot. I'm actually not sure. Let me actually check that. The artifact strong boxes. Can you can you target the slot that it comes out as? No, I don't think you can. No, generates a random artifact of the series. No, so you don't even get to choose the slot. Like you can't even you can't even choose whether it's like the flower slot or the the feather slot. Is just a random artifact of that series. Yeah, no, that's ba so it is basically equivalent to doing the domain. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I feel like it's just easier to do the domain to to get artifacts, and then as well, um, since you're not sacrificing the artifacts to to create artifacts then you can sacrifice the artifacts to level artifacts. I feel like that's more efficient. Uh, I can't believe we're I can't believe we're missing I can't believe we're missing it by like we're literally missing it by like 1 second. It's making that ominous music again. Okay, we did, okay, last time we did this team, and we missed it by, like, one or two seconds. And then we did Yelan with her. Hmm, the big thing is that Yelan takes too long to charge her burst. That's one thing that I don't like about this. Can we, hmm... Do we have another option for who to use? Could we use Navia? Would that be... Would that be feasible to use Navia though? Because Zhongli is really amazing for keeping us alive. That's the whole point of him. It's the big shield. I also gotta figure out how to stun that Ruin Serpent more. Not that. Uh, archive. 
Emma, if you, if you keep watching, you're going to fall asleep in the chat. Hey, I mean, if, uh, if I'm able to relax you enough that you can fall asleep, then I guess I must be doing something right. I don't know, since it's supposed to be, since it's supposed to be a, you know, a comfortable stream. Create oozing consecration. Okay. Looming light from your Luvian stone edge. We're going to destroy the oozing. Uh, yeah, okay. Knock it out. Wait, destroy this. Yeah, it is also really late. For sure, for sure. I understand the struggle. <clears throat> to destroy the oozing consecrations, concretions, feeding power to the rune serpent to knock it out of the state. Hmm. Cause the energy cores on its body cease functioning. Okay, I want to do. I'm gonna probably do one more try on Spiral Bus 12.1, and then I think from there I'll probably end the stream. Emma, I appreciate that you've had a good time watching, and I, I'm glad that uh, that you were able to enjoy the the content. <laughs> You'll watch this? Okay, okay. Yeah, I just need, I'm I'm gonna try to do one more try here. I don't know. That's the biggest thing I hear that I don't well I wonder if you, hmm. Maybe Okay, wait, 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 wait. What if What if I do Oh, what if I do Venti or Kazua? Would that help? Because then he's doing constant damage to, especially the breachers, especially those breachers in the middle. Yeah, okay, maybe we, because Hu Tao is kind of putting us off to the side whenever she does that. Can we do it this way? And then, yeah, keep Kokomi as the main DPS, but then Kazuha is going to be able to keep us rounded or keep them close together the first couple enemies though this the oh, okay actually that might work that, okay that might help that might help and then any adjustments to this i guess the, if we're doing adjustments if we're doing adjustments it might be something to do with energy recharge on yalan um or, oh, we still don't have Raiden. We still can't use Raiden here. Maybe that? Okay, maybe we could try Navi on this. Yeah, I won't have, I won't have a perfect shield, but Navi can also do some damage too. So that might help. Okay. I do have to worry about not getting killed when this when this happens. All right, we're experimenting. We're experimenting. Let's see how this goes. Reset. Oh my god. Nope. Come on. Can we open this again? Is this actually making it better? Okay, kind of. Bring this back up. That back up. Go. Fighting. Endless fight. I don't know if this is actually doing better. Or not. Oh, maybe a little bit. Okay, that might be a little bit better. Okay, okay, hold on. Um, I need to remember what are we doing here first. I think Nahida. And then, oh, I guess. 
I don't know if I want to do that right off the bat with Navia. We'll start with this. I have to be good on staying alive, though. That's the only problem. Okay, he's doing the spin move. Okay, I guess staying alive is not entirely, ter not entirely too difficult. Get a little bit of energy back. Nice. Oh my god. Oh, he's going back down. Come on, I'm trying to see if we can stun. We can stun, we stun, we stun, we stun. Nice, nice. Oh my god. Oh, we got a little bit on it. This is doable. We can get the, uh, get the damage here. 30 seconds. Oh, everything's so close. Oh, we have the burst. Ow. Don't go underground. Don't go underground. Don't go underground. Oh, okay, I'd rather you hit me than for you to go underground. 10 seconds. No! Die! How are you not dead? What? Wait. How did that not kill him? Okay. I'm convinced that this team could do it though. We probably did, we didn't do it this time, but after seeing that, I'm pretty convinced this team can do it. Okay. So no three stars on 12-1 tonight, but we've got the experiment there. He hit me with the Uno reverse card. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what just happened. I mean, it, it looked like it was zero to me. That honestly looked like a zero. That honestly looked like zero HP right there. But... All right, well, I guess I'll go F myself then. All righty. Okay, well, that's, uh... I guess that'll be our our trial of the Spiral Abyss tonight. You cool? Uh, I guess I could at least claim what we did yet. Oh, whoops! That's actually abandoned the challenge. You can't just leave. Abandon. There we go. 450 primos right there. Okay. Things are shaping up. Okay, so with that, we're gonna end off the stream on that note. Um, hopefully you all enjoyed um, watching tonight's stream, the two of you that made it out. Um, thanks for all, thanks all for coming out. Hope you enjoyed, or I, okay, done it. obviously I said that already. Um, Thanks for taking the effort to uh, to make it out. Um, if you're watching this after the live stream has concluded, thanks for watching the, uh, the video. And um, hope to see you all in a future stream. So, as always, have a good rest of your night or day, wherever you are. And uh, hope to see you in the next one. That's gonna be all for me. And so it'll just be bye for now.